I will try to upload a few old uh, videos from my former channel Radio M232 this is a video from 2008 in which I showed uh, my counter it's the type 5245L from Hewlett Packard and the interesting thing from this counter is that it is completely made with uh, transistors transistor logic uh, flip flop flops and uh, in the manual I also uh, found that perhaps diode logic is used and a very interesting thing from this uh, counter was of course that it worked with Nixie tubes small neon tubes inside the tube there is a sort of construction with wire and the neon gas uh, lights up orange and indicates uh, the notes on the um, inside the tube you see a lot of transistors and I'm taking out in this video one of the boards in a later moment this is by the way the, um, the way it worked here we have a flip-flop circuit it's from the original uh, manual go back now to the counter video and the whole manual is available on the internet and everyone interested in antique electronics uh, can uh, download the, the original manual here you see one of the printed boards very clear to see that uh, transistors are used and uh, resistors so the whole thing worked with flip flop flip flops Schmidt triggers, uh, one shot uh, multi vibrators, etc. And this tube here is the crystal oven. Inside here was a precision crystal. It uh, was kept on a constant temperature. Um, the reason was, of course, that the frequency had to be very stable. This was the top from the counters in those days and it costed in those days um, 15,000 guilders approximately I bought it for uh, 260 guilders in a dump shop army dump shop here you see the typical neon um, Nixie tubes very funny to see how the this jumps from the backside to the foreside to the front when the when it changes from a 2 to a 1 or a 7 so a very interesting uh, old counter and from a very high quality it lasted in my case approximately uh, 30 years